Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be filming my mug collection. I have many, many mugs back here behind me. I just want to thank you all for voting on my little poll on YouTube and, you know, voting for the mug collection over the candle collection. I might still do the candle collection for anyone who wants to see that as well. So just leave me a comment down below if you want to see that in the future. I have quite a few less um, candles though as I do mugs. Um, I love collecting things very much and it's kind of a bad habit of mine because once I grab something like off the shelf I have a very very hard time um, putting it back like I get attached to things way too quickly and some of these mugs were purchases because I just couldn't put it back because I felt too bad after picking it up and all that kind of stuff so as like dumb as it may seem a lot of these are purchases because of that. So I'm just going to give you guys an overview here and then I'm going to go into each of the mugs and I know that there's a lot so I'm not going to talk about each one you know too much. Most of them I got from TJ Maxx, some of them I got as gifts and also places that I've gone like traveled to, things like that. Most of them have come from TJ Maxx because they have mugs that are usually like $4.99. Um, I think the most that I've ever seen there is $7.99 and but most of these that i've got are, have been like 4 dollars so i've just picked it up if i look down the mug um aisle in tj maxx and that store is extremely dangerous because i get way too many things there that i just don't need because they have like so many good things there but either way so i'm gonna get into the mugs there's no real order to this no like favorites to least favorites or oldest or whatever so i'm just gonna start grabbing and Hopefully this video won't be too long, so let's start right now. I'm gonna start with this mug right here, and it's a very cute fox with a little Santa hat on it, and again, this did come from TJ Maxx. If I can remember where they came from, I'll let you guys know. Um, TJ Maxx has things that go very quickly, so I won't be able to link anything um, because I think they get kind of overstocked from other stores and then it just gets put in there and then once it's gone, it's gone. But I found this one and it's adorable and I have a lot of fox mugs here and you'll think that my favorite animal is a fox instead of a wolf because I actually only have one wolf mug, which is extremely sad, but there's just not enough um, like wolf merch out there like cute stuff like this. It's always like an angry looking wolf So I never really get it because I don't really think that way of them But either way, this is the first mug that I got at TJ Maxx and it's pretty recent and I just got it because you know I like Christmas very much and I thought it was really cute it just has the red on the inside and So yeah, that is the first mug. I'm going to show you guys. This one is a mug that has the Leo on it and it shows like the um, characteristics on it on here and everything and I am a Leo in the astrology signs and I know it's kind of shocking because my personality doesn't always match a Leo somewhat but not all the way but I thought this one was really really pretty I really like the detail that they put into it and it just has Leo across there and the lion and everything like that so I thought this one was really pretty and I really liked it I think this one this one came from I think it has on the bottom Williams Sonoma this is about the only thing that I could afford in that store because their stuff is way too expensive. But anyway, I got this mug from there because I saw it in the window when I was in the mall. Next comes my Sedona, Arizona mug. As you saw recently, I have vlogs and I'll put them up in the screen or down in the description. Um, I went to Arizona recently and got one of these mugs just because it was my first time to Arizona so I decided to get kind of a novelty mug there. So I like this one because it's short and it fits perfectly in my Keurig and it has really cool writing on it and everything so this is the next one a very nice clear mug here my brother actually had one of these oh my face looks so weird um my brother actually had one of these um it comes from the world market and he had one of these and i was really jealous of it because i was all like it's like hot chocolate would look great in this thing so literally that was my mindset and so my friend lizzie lives near a, a world market so i went there and literally got one like a week after I saw my brother had one because I kept like stealing his so that I could uh, put hot chocolate in it so there's like an Instagram post of this one up somewhere on my Instagram so I thought it was really pretty it's simple but it's really really pretty 
Next was also a mug that came from World Market. My mom got this one for me because another collection thing that I do is plants and I've really been trying to cut back because I buy way too many plants and I do not have a green thumb so they all end up dying. So this one has succulents all over it which is perfect because I was really obsessed with succulents for a while. I still am but they keep dying on me. It just says crazy plant lady on the inside so I thought this one was really cute and so she got it for me. Then I got this one a little while ago. I haven't had a chance to use this yet because I just have so many mugs as you can see. And this one just came from Walmart. They had a little fall section there and a cute fox mug. So I thought it was really adorable. Most of the reasons why I picked these up is because I think they're adorable. So not any real deep meanings to all of these, but yeah. Next is a small travel mug. And unfortunately it got really messed up because I left it to soak in the sink and it has paper around it, so it got really messed up, but it's a K-pop mug from Big Bang, and I got this with my friend Stacy while we were in Little Tokyo, maybe even Koreatown, there was a store there that's all about music stuff, so here it is, you can see all the damage that was done to it, unfortunately, with all these watermarks on it, but I love Big Bang, and they were one of the first bands that I ever listened to in K-pop, so I'm really sad that they're not currently making music right now, but they're doing their Korean duties in the army. But either way, Top is definitely my bias out of all of them. I love him. So that is this one. I've had this one for a super long time. And I'm not going to show you the, look, the uh, mug because, I mean the top of the mug, because it's really dirty. <laughs> and it's all dusty and everything. Next in the collection is this one right here. This one came from TJ Maxx. It says, I love my dog because... I really love my dog and obviously self-explanatory. I don't know why I had to explain that to you guys. And he's all over my Instagram and I love him very much. So I got this one just because I thought it was cute and it's a really nice size. Another mug from TJ Maxx. My mom got me and her a matching one of this. It says eat, sleep, yoga, repeat. Um, I was really into yoga for a while and unfortunately I have stopped. It has a little smiley face in it there. I stopped recently and have gotten really bad at it but I got she got me this one because I was into yoga at the time so I would love to get back into it so that this would actually like apply to me so this next mug is one of the purchases that I mentioned before that once I picked it up I felt really bad and I couldn't put it back on the shelf and it's this little pig mug and I know that he's supposed to be sleeping but for some reason when I put him back on the shelf he just looks so sad and I know how it, like I sound so crazy and some people are probably gonna be like wow like you need to go like get help but <laughs> he looked sad to me so I couldn't put him back on the shelf and I had to take him with me and he was only like $2.99 so it has a bunch of little um, X's on the inside there and I just thought it was really adorable and I couldn't put it back so I had to take him with me and so yeah there's the little sleepy slash sad pig next mug I actually got from a Washington uh, state trip and we went to the Woodland Park Zoo. I will also link that vlog in the description or up in the screen somewhere and I mean of course I had to get a mug there like if I'm starting a collection you know I had to get a mug there and I really really loved the zoo even though we didn't get to see very much of it because they had some wolves there and they take very very good care of their animals and they have amazing enclosures so I got this one there it's a nice size and my mom also got one to match. This one's a little bit dusty so because I haven't used it in a while but this one is a doggy behavior chart and there are quite a few dog ones in here as well and it says good dog bad dog it came with a stick of chalk but I don't know where that is now I got this a few years ago but I thought it was cute and it's really big so you can put a lot of like coffee or hot chocolate in it and I thought it was a cute little mug and like I said most of these are just because I thought they were cute no real reason behind them so I picked that one up. It's also from TJ Maxx. How many times can I say uh, TJ Maxx is the dangerous store? <laughs> I got this one from there as well. It says believe in yourself. It's like such a cheesy saying, uh, but it was the only one with this really nice blue color. The one that I really wanted that had a nice saying on it was like yellow and I really don't like the color yellow. So I just ended up getting this one because um, I mean it's a good saying I guess and it was a cool like knitted almost like sweater kind of material and it was around winter I think last year I got it. And so I got this one mostly because I really like this color, but the saying is pretty cheesy, but 
you know, you gotta believe in yourself. This one is a travel mug, just a little small one. It says, I give no fox. <laughs> and I really liked it and it has an orange lid on it that just pops off. And I just put this in coffee if I'm going to school and it has just a little, you know, like a slip lid on it here. Next is another K-pop um, travel mug and this one is for Vix. Vix is, has been my all-time favorite K-pop band so far and Leo is my bias. Let me find him, there he is in there. Next is another gift from my mom from TJ Maxx. It's an owl mug and has a really cool like wood kind of um, handle on it even though it's ceramic and I think it's just really pretty. She got me this for Christmas I think either last year or the year before that. Next is another very big mug and I honestly rarely use these big mugs just because there is so much on it. I ended up not finishing the drink but I got this one because it was really pretty. I like the design on it. It says enjoy the little things and for some reason it reminded me of like an Edgar Allan Poe book that I used to have a long time ago. It had all the short stories in it and it was this gray and black color. I have no idea what happened to it since then. I got it like around elementary school but I really liked it. Another gift from my mother and like a mug is definitely like one of the foolproof gifts that I will absolutely love like every single time and this one is from Starbucks. It was actually on sale after Christmas and I really liked it. It was really adorable. It has a fox on it with his tail as the handle and I think it's just really pretty and simple. This next one Stacy actually got for me. She traveled to Paris one year and she got me a little mug and it's really adorable and it has a place for this handle here. So you can put if you you know take sugar in your coffee, which I don't, but either for like tea and you can put honey in it. So I thought it was really adorable and it's such a cute little mug and I'm really happy because you know she got this from Paris itself. So I was really happy when she brought this to me. So speaking of Edgar Allan Poe in the other mug, um, I got this one and it's a quote by Edgar Allan Poe. And it says, there is no beauty without strangeness. And you can see his name down there. This is my most recent addition to my collection and I got it from the Coffee Bean and they had really cute mugs this year. And it's hot cocoa and fuzzy socks. And another collection of mine that <laughs> actually just happened this year is fuzzy socks. And I posted a picture of that on Instagram as well. So I thought this was perfect because I love hot chocolate and my new collection is fuzzy socks. This mug I got from Target. I saw it when I was visiting my friend Lizzie and she used to work at Target and we went there one day. Or I went there one day while she was working and it says warm and cozy on it. Um, this one is perfect for Instagram posts because it's so nice and I put hot chocolate in it usually. This next one I actually can't really remember where I got it from. I think it was honestly like something like the dollar store. Um, I don't know what, well, like my mom and I were shopping probably for some decorations there because they have some like surprisingly good decorations at the dollar store but I got this one there because I thought it was cute. It's almost like a snowman with a scarf on and it has a really nice um, like knitted little cozy here. Next is a mug from my dad and this I got for Christmas one year and it says I love my dog a latte and I think it's adorable. It's such a good size too for the Keurig and you know I've said many times many times like I love my dog so and everyone knows it so he got me this one and I think it was really adorable. It was either actually it might have been for my birthday. I think it was actually for my birthday instead of Christmas so he got this one for me and I really like it a lot. So next one, don't judge me too harshly. <laughs> um, I was in love with Twilight, you know, when I was in middle school, high school, and I still honestly do love Twilight. You know, it was like a good period in my life, okay? So the first time my mom and I went to Washington State, I made her go to Forks, Washington because I was obsessed. And in one of the stores, they had this mug here, and it says run with the pack on it and it has a wolf this is the only wolf mug that i own unfortunately and it says la push washington we did go to la push and we went to all the spots in the um movie so i got this one then to uh, there to commemorate the memory so this is the last tj maxx mug i swear i should be like sponsored by tj maxx i go there so often but it's another little fox mug and i thought it was really cute and the shape is what really like attracted me to it because it's such a cool little shape and has nice color inside with the little fox in the bottom so when you're done with your drink you can see him down there. I swear like everyone gets me mugs so this one's for my brother and he got me this Domo mug and he also got me some coasters to go with it. I think it's adorable. Domo was really really cute and 
He got me this for Christmas a few years ago. I use the coasters all the time, like on my desk or on my nightstand or whatever. And we've come to the end. This is the very last mug. And I got this one from TJ Maxx a few Christmases ago. The little reindeer with a scarf on. And they had Santa as well, but he kind of looked like really strange. Like all of his eyes were painted strange. And now I'm looking at this one. He looks kind of creepy too, but trust me, the Santa Clauses were way creepier. So I just got this one instead. So that is it for my big mug collection and I know that the video was kind of long and I hope it wasn't too boring just because I just showed it and like talked about where it came from but I'm really happy that you guys wanted to see it and that you actually voted on the poll. Trust me, I was not like, I didn't think I was going to get any um, votes on the poll just because I am still like a pretty small channel but I'm really really happy that you guys wanted to see this one. Give me a like on this video if you enjoyed it and tell me which mug you liked out of all the millions of mugs that I have here. And subscribe for new videos in the future and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.